And welcome aboard Stop Work Order. We're a Lagoon 52. Uh, the boat was built in 2017. My name's Ryan, I'm the captain and the dive master, or excuse me, dive instructor. And this is my wife, Danny. She is the chef and uh, everything else on the boat. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're going to show you guys around the outside right now, or I am. Um, right now, we're standing in our cockpit area here. You can see we have a lovely bar with a sink. Uh, there's refrigerators and ice makers. <clears throat> uh, we have this beautiful custom mahogany table we had made last year. Uh, it helps enable us to sit eight people a lot more comfortably than uh, our prior table did. Um, let's move around and up the port side of the boat. Up here you'll see our two-person kayak. Um, we are a, um, I don't want to call it a dive-focused boat, but I enjoy diving immensely. Um, so we carry um, eight dive tanks. Actually, it's nine, uh, so that I have one to go out with all eight of our guests. Uh, but love to take people on dives throughout the Caribbean. Uh, probably one of my favorite things about this job. <clears throat> up front, you'll see just a kind of a sample of toys we have. We have a sub wing which is kind of like being a dolphin in the water. Uh, we call it a lazy man snorkeling also because you just kind of hang on and ride around tubes and wakeboards, um, fishing gear, all sorts of other stuff. A beautiful little sun deck up here for people to enjoy the, uh, the shade or the sun, whichever time of day it is. <clears throat> uh, very convenient too. We have two windows right behind here. We kind of call it the drive-through. So all you have to do is turn around and kind of give us a wink and we'll bring your new drink to you. <clears throat> Pay no attention to these paddle boards. They will be gone when you get on the boat. Uh, we are getting two brand new ones this year. <clears throat> As you can see, a lovely little holder of snorkel gear here. Uh, we use all Cressy gear on the boat, which is a French made company, which is probably one of the highest quality snorkel gears you can get. <clears throat> Up top at the flybridge, is my favorite part of the boat. This is where um, I sit around and press buttons and act busy uh, while my wife's downstairs making delicious meals. Um, fully convertible seating up here on the uh, flybridge. Um, these two seats here actually also double. I can actually remove this real quick. You can see one table here. There's also another table underneath. Uh, we like to pop these up in the evening for cocktails and kind of turn it into like an alfresco dining area. Lots of lines for sailing. Uh, the boat does extremely well um, with sailing. Uh, the fastest we've ever had the boat going is about 11 knots, which is actually very competitive for a boat of this size. And since we are outside, I will do the one cabin that is accessible through the cockpit. We call this the spaceship because of the door. A lot of people feel like Princess Leia when they come out of it. And down here you'll find one of four queen beds that Stop Work Order has to offer. Um, one of the big advantages uh, to this vessel also is in here in the bathroom. You will see that it is actually separated. Uh, you do not have a wet head it was what we call a dry head, so the toilet is actually separated from the shower area. Uh, tons of storage and things like that on the boat also to make it extremely comfortable to bring all your luggage. And now I'm going to hand you off to the chef so she can show you the rest of the boat on the inside. All right. Come on in. So in the salon area here, we have lots of space. Um, it's great for when, you know, it might be rainy or anything or um, uh, anybody needs to be in the air and, you know, cool off. This little guy is hidden. Everybody loves it because they think we don't have a TV, but we do. So we, um, if we have any, you know, kind of weather or anything, we can play video games and watch movies and kids love it for morning cartoons and stuff like that. So um, that's nice to have. 
We'll go down to starboard side. This is our master cabin. Um, very spacious. Tons of storage for all of your um, luggage and all of the extra clothing that you bring that you never wear because <laughs> you're in your bathing suit all the time. Um, this one's nice. Um, the shower and the sink over here are separate. And then your head is over here. So you have that nice separation. The master also has lots of closet space. All of these storage, there's drawers below for storage. Um, the reading lamps and the fan, all very, um, very nice um, amenities. So as we come out this way, in our starboard forward, um, both forward cabins are mirrored, they're identical. Um, queens, again, lots of storage. Um, other thing to add, all of our rooms have their own uh, controlled air conditioning. So you can set the temperature to whatever you like, um, turn it on and off whenever you like, and it doesn't affect anyone else on the boat. The head here, um, again, like Ryan was saying, the shower has a nice door there so you don't have any wet head. And all of the um, toilets are fresh water, so you never get that boat kind of smell sometimes in the heads so other nice thing in the rooms um, I didn't mention all of these shades for privacy and keep the sun out in the morning a lot of people come down they're like wow everybody can see right in so they're really easy to open and close as well which people really enjoy right we'll go up and over to the other side And again, very similar, just uh, mirrored from the starboard side. Um, same storage as the other forward, um, same bathroom, all the same amenities. Very nice. Um, oh, yes, <laughs> very nice, um, spacious um, storage as well. So identical to the other one. And then if you're wondering where we sleep, We'll leave the door closed on this one, but these are our bunk beds here in this door. Um, that's where Captain Ryan and I live. Um, we do offer the option if you have children or, you know, teenagers that need to share a room, we will move out of it into a queen if, you know, they know if they want the bunks. So that's always an option. Not very often that people pass up a queen, but sometimes they do like the bunks. Galley, this is where you find me most of the time <laughs> in here. Um, love to make delicious meals for everybody out of this galley. <laughs>